Good evening, folks. This is Redway Matt coming to you with another Red's Bedtime Story. And I thought I'd start out about Facebook and the people I'm reaching on Facebook and the people I'm not reaching on Facebook. But it's really not about me as much as it is about other people. But then again, it may be about me. I don't know. There are some people that like me, some people that don't like me. There are people that were that think that I was just a rat. I ratted people out for no good reason. And obviously I did have a reason for everything that I did. And I have a reason for doing this. And I also had a reason for writing a book. And my main reason for writing the book was I was encouraged. I was encouraged very much by John Drummond, by John Flood, from the Combined Counties uh, Police Association and other people. They said if I didn't write it, nobody would ever know the truth. Nobody would ever know the stories as they really happen. So I did. And I've gotten into some controversy. There are some people that really don't like me. And it's just like anything else. If you don't like something, tune it out. I'm not asking anybody to love me or like me or anything else. I'm just putting myself out there for you to look at. Uh, it was brought up to me yesterday that uh, I take advantage of uh, people on social security checks, uh, people that are, don't have any money, and try to encourage them to buy my book. Uh, that isn't the real reason. The real reason was to get out the story. It does cost to publish a book and get it done. And when you have a publisher like I did that walked out on me and uh, just kind of erased me, I didn't give up. I, I kept going forward. And that's why I suggest to you. But also, I would say this. Uh, for those that, of you that really don't care for me, it's not hard to say, I don't want to talk to you. Or it's not even hard for you to say, um, nothing. Just ignore me. And I'll try and ignore you, you know, if you don't want me to get involved in it. But the truth of the matter is, uh, I keep saying the truth of the matter because that's my vernacular. This is the way I am, and these are the reasons I do. I think I have strong moral fiber. Uh, some people don't. They think uh, because I was in a shady business, pornography, um, some people might call it uh, immoral. Um, it's still around though, I'll tell you that much. But aside from that, um, I did it. I didn't particularly care for it at the time. And anybody that's read my book understands it was a headache. It was a big headache. I was encouraged to do it by the FBI and gain more information and put some bad people away. People that hurt people for no reason at all in my account. Um, until you have somebody that's uh, murdered or something's really done that's not necessary, in your opinion, uh, to get the point across, then you really can't understand. You don't understand it until it affects you personally. A lot of these things did affect me personally. I talked to a man last night who was very much affected by the way I was marketing my book. Um, he said uh, that I was taking advantage of people. I've had other people come to the other side of me and say, we like your stories, we like what you say. But some of these people, uh, one of them was uh, a real nice guy. He really is. He's, uh, I asked him if, his, uh, if, his, uh, if he was related to Sam Carlisi, which he is. And he turns out to be a real nice guy. And uh, he's, he's just in groups learning and about things that they never told him. Or like uh, Frank Schweiss's cousin. Um, He's somebody that's in there that's learning things and doing things and wants to know how much other people know about things. So at any rate, uh, that's kind of my uh, Good Friday Easter message to you folks. I hope you all have a good Easter, each and every one of you. And I, I feel very grateful that some of you are, uh, you don't have to like me, all of you. Yeah, I mean. It's not a personality contest. I'm not trying to win anything. But uh, what I would like to do is tell you that if you're really interested 
You can get an autographed copy of my book at redwaymet.com or you can buy a non-autographed book at Amazon, uh, Books A Million, Barnes & Noble. Um, you can order it from any of those companies. Uh, there's 28,000 of them now. And the truth of the matter is, uh, you might enjoy it and you might not. I think some of the reviews that came in were very, very good. Um, and I encourage people to write reviews. But also, I want to give you a wish. And my wish is that you all have a wonderful Easter, that you all have a wonderful weekend, and that you all live, laugh, love, and be happy. God bless you.